adequate nutrition provides the building blocks of life for children. From conception until two years of age, they go through the most significant period of growth. A lack of nutrients in the diet and frequent infections at this time make these children especially vulnerable to poor growth. They can become malnourished. Malnutrition has a major impact on young children. It can prevent normal physical and mental growth and development, as well as prevent future participation in society as a healthy individual. In short, without adequate nutrition, their full potential is not achieved. In communities where 30% or an absolute number of 30 children or more are malnourished, in this case, underweight or low weight for their age, a community project model called Positive Deviance Hearth can be used to address this problem. Positive Deviance Hearth focuses on children ages 6 to 36 months of age. The community discovers local solutions to overcome malnutrition by seeing what behaviors around feeding, hygiene, caring, and health-seeking practices are already used by other caregivers and families that lead to healthy child growth. These low-cost, positive practices and locally available nutrient-rich foods are then shared with the rest of the community. So what is positive deviance and what is a hearth? Positive deviance is when community members practice behaviors which result in positive outcomes. Positive deviance are the caregivers or families from low resource households who practice uncommon yet positive feeding, hygiene, caring, and health seeking behaviors. These enable them to have healthy children even though they have access to the same resources and are facing similar or worse challenges than other families. These practices are the local solutions waiting to be identified and shared with a larger community which is done by meeting together at a hearth, a cozy, warm place in the home where food is prepared and cooked. Through learning by doing, a small group of caregivers in the community practice positive behaviors for 10 to 12 days in hearth sessions, facilitated by community volunteers. At these sessions, an energy and nutrient-dense meal and snack is prepared and fed to the children in the program daily using locally available, low-cost foods contributed by the participant caregivers. These are followed by home visits conducted by the volunteers for two weeks. In summary, through this program, rehabilitation is provided to underweight children in a community-based setting. Families are equipped to rehabilitate and prevent malnutrition with their community solutions in their homes using local resources. And the program aims to prevent future malnutrition of children ages 6 to 36 months in the community so that both the immediate children participating in the program and children who will grow up in the community benefit from the local solutions. World Vision has implemented Positive Deviance Hearth in 40 countries around the world to help communities find local and sustainable solutions to child malnutrition. World Vision has scaled up Positive Deviance Hearth across countries such as Bangladesh, where over 32,000 malnourished children and their caregivers participated in 2015 alone, with more than half of the children fully rehabilitating within the first three months of attending the program. It is also being effectively used as a platform to integrate nutrition with various sectors in different African and Asian countries, incorporating nutrition-sensitive agriculture, economic development, and water, sanitation, and hygiene programming with Positive Deviance Heart. Together with communities, World Vision has worked to ensure quality by developing standard training curricula and protocols for Positive Deviance Heart. World Vision also uses innovative methods to improve technical components and community monitoring